Am I good to go? My name is Yolo. I'm 19 years old. And my strange addiction is sneaking into events. I started sneaking in to events way before this YouTube stuff. I used to do skits on Instagram. We talking hottest looks. No homo, but that nigga Jack Harlow cute. Oh, oh shit. shit. Can you rate my cameraman? One to ten. Like a million. A million. A million. Look at you. I think you should get a snap. <laughs> oh. <laughs> question is how do you approach a guy uh, come here papi let me get your numbers Hadi. i'm here with this man you have the perks <laughs> oh <No. laughs> uh, we bought a uh, mdma and turns out it was meth so we did a little <laughs> before i started youtube i used to make instagram videos shorts so I would say 2018. It all started when, way before this YouTube stuff, I used to do these type of sneaking in, way before this, maybe even these Instagram vids. It started at movie theaters, and I used to get in movie theaters just like that. I used to be like, I forgot my phone, gotta go get, you know what I mean? So that's, that's, I'm giving y'all games. The most recent I can think of was when I started doing this on YouTube. I think the first one was Mr. Bobby Wardell, aka Destroy Lonely. I heard that Ken Carson was uh, performing today, so I'm like, bet I'm gonna show up. Not for the music, but for the sneaking in event, because I'm the best at sneaking in, boy. <laughs> Turn up, we just sneaked in. You know what I'm saying? Best zero dollar I just spent. <laughs> the first time I snuck into his concert was crazy. The reason I do these is because, you know, if you know me personally or not, I don't do drugs, I don't smoke. I don't drink, I don't sniff. I even said it in my song, you know. Gotta put my boom out. Go check out my song, you know what I mean? But I don't smoke, I don't drink, I don't sniff. All of this energy, yeah, I'm just ready. I don't do those type of things. But me entering a, an event like that, concert, whether it's concert, a game, or a show, It's just the adrenaline that rushes into my body is just insane. I love it, you know? And it's the best adrenaline that, you know, like getting chased, whether it's getting chased or getting surrounded by, you know? It's just a thrill of getting past security, the experience, I don't know. I think that's, that's, that's me. I just, I don't, I don't do drugs, but that, that's my drug. That's, that's my adrenaline rush that I need. And I love it. I won't say it's how I do it, you know. Can't put out a secret. But what I uh, could say is, you just gotta be. You gotta act like you belong there. You gotta act like you have your ticket, or you gotta act like you, you know. Like you're supposed to be in there. That's one thing you gotta be. You can't just be shy and walking around. I have to get now. Like you gotta, uh, yeah, type shit. You know what I mean? But yeah. By the way, this is. Um, Educational purposes only. I do buy tickets. I just want to see if every time I get in a concert or a festival or a game, I can sneak in. But I do be purchasing, you know, the tickets. Yeah. 
I would say I never got caught or just like mistaken by someone or just like kicked out at an event. But, you know, I, uh, I got into some altercation with some security. Really took me as, you know, as a criminal, though. I had two concerts that I uh, almost got kicked out. It's at the Lil TJ's video and at the, and the SCH, the French artist. As you guys already know, the security just told me to take out the camera. Nah, bro, no, 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 no some anger issue shit. And the other altercation with the security guard was the little TJ one. He caught me inside with, with a camera and just started screaming at me. I don't know why. Fuck are you Bro, doing? I was in the front. But yo, security told me to get in the pack. I'm like, it's you! And then bro, we got lit. Where were you at? Me, I was all the way back, bro. We did on a pack for the girls. <laughs> For the girl! What do you think about the little DJ concert? Not bad, not bad. Not bad? Not bad. <laughs> started screaming, you're not allowed. I remember that. And I was like, he just started yelling. One of my, one of my uh, close friends, I know his name is uh, Flacco. AKA Big O, if you guys you know know him, he's been through uh, a few concerts with me, and he is the reason I also bring him is just to prove people that I'm not faking it, that I can bring someone with me, you know. And his point of view of this whole thing, I can actually call him if you want. Kind of getting severe and it's, it's it's bad that's almost the only thing i think about day and night whether i'm working sleeping walking <laughs> that's all i think about what's my next move what's my next concert to get into will i ever stop predict the future you know how do I do it that's one thing I have to say to people when they ask me how I do it I just I just look at them and the secret cannot be told the secret cannot be you know what I mean you know ex <laughs> you know what I'm saying like yeah the secret cannot be told the part of the reason I really do this is because it shows that you can really do anything you really want. If you really put your mind into it, like, bro, every time I'm in front of the concert, there's this one moment of it. I'm just thinking, like, I might not be in, like, I might, and then I, I just start thinking to myself, I don't think I'm going to get in. I don't think I'm going to make it in. Next thing you know, I'm in it. And that works for every single one of them. I did this, bro. I even, bro, this is hot. Bro, so this is again. Damn, look at you. Look at it again. Stop playing with me. Here, you know, it just climbed and history. Yeah, I'm yeah. saying? You made it, in it. Ah! Uh, I, yo! Yo! 
Je vais faire un bar. 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 Je vais Yo sneak into this, yo sneak into this, yo sneak into this, yo sneak. It was just like people wanted me to enter every concert, festivals, shows, games that were going place in you know my city. So I was just with it, honestly. You know, I didn't really see the bad side of it. And with that, you know, me getting in, there's a lot of benefits, as in a lot of good things that happen. Um, I. I think for me personally, the biggest till this day is I, you know, I got for it was uh, from the Lil TJ video. I got in contact with the Lil TJ's DJ and we're tapped in. Yo 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 come here, out of here. Yo yo the after party. Get litty. Okay, Kredo, it's my birthday. What's up with you? What's up with you, fam? In the frame. Guys, back up! Yeah. Stop pushing this! Yeah. Yeah. Guys, clear the floor! Can you DJ Dre Black, I'll tag you. So I, can... I got you, I got you! Guys, guys! Let's go! Let's stop pushing! Yeah, that's pretty cool. It's, it's pretty crazy, I don't know. It just proves that you can literally do whatever you want to do if you really put your mind into it. And, you know... Yeah. You really, if you really put your mind into it, you can really make something happen out of it. I don't think something could actually stop me at this point. It's just an addiction I have. It's hard to stop when you're, it's very hard to stop when you're, you know, it's just like smoking. I don't smoke, but you know, a lot of people will be saying it's hard to stop when you're addicted. It's the same thing. I, I love the addiction of just going crazy dancing it's just after when you sneak in it's not even after just rushing into it it's when you're in whatever like event you are you're in it dance you know what i mean i, I love dancing it's just this <laughs> the thing about me is i love dancing i'd be dancing everywhere getting to know more from the artist like loving him like i'm talking crazy like you only listen like when you listen to an artist compared to after you snuck in and you saw him face to face like you, you seeing him perform and listening to his music is not the same thing like for example me getting into destroy lonely's concert like i didn't know who that was after i snuck into his concert the first time like two years ago i did not know who that was I didn't know who Ken Carson was. I, I wasn't on social media that much. I wasn't tapped in. When I got home that day, like the next day, I started like replaying the song and I just got, it's like, yo, this is, this is crazy. Like I really met these people. Like I really saw them perform and listening to them sing is just crazy. It's just a whole different vibe. And till this day, I, I listen to Destroy now. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to, out of these, what I'm trying to get is probably perform with the artist on stage. That'd be nice. Just imagine me with the artist performing a song. That'd be lit. But for now, you know, I just, I'll just keep doing me, man. Yolo on the beat and you know he lit
I was thinking about dropping that resin on the car, but I put that shit right on my teeth. I used to be shy about smiling and shit. Now I be smiling on all of my vid. You balance my shoes and my shirt and my pants. Yeah, you know, might as well put them some night. Hold on.